plaques will offer another side to history's Andrew Jackson and the two statues to him in county buildings. He was a lifelong slaveholder and helped force thousands of Native Americans off their homeland, leading to the deadly Trail of Tears. It's been standing out there uh, with the erection of this building, and it's time. It's simply time. Part of it will read, we must acknowledge past injustices to help us create a greater nation. County Executive Frank White helps run the courthouses, but... My not even being included in the conversation uh, is offensive. I really, I really believe that uh, I should have been one of the people in the room. He also thinks Native Americans and African Americans should have been consulted. This debate was unusual. Once this is now brought up, then we're going to have people that say the statue should be removed. I don't believe that. But I wonder why we got to talk about the Native Americans. I'm sorry? Why do we have to talk about the Native Americans? Finley was looking for more details. I mean, I'd change the county to Truman County or name it after some extraordinary woman who's lived in this county. In the end, legislators voted to add an explanation plaque, one that says that in addition to being a war hero and president of the United States, Andrew Jackson had his flaws. Michael Mahoney, KMBC 9 News.